So one of the things about Wilmington is people are always asking, where can I get something good to eat? So what Zach Phillips and I did, what did we do, Zach? Well, we decided that rather than Rather than review restaurants, mm -hmm. what we actually want to do is we want to review individual food items. Oh my gosh. And one thing that causes a lot of controversy here in Wilmington right. is jerk chicken. Jerk chicken. So we're going to do an entire uh, series right. on jerk chicken, starting with my personal favorite, although in, 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 I have to be honest that I haven't tried everywhere, Right. but uh, D&H on 4th Street at the corner of 4th and King. Awesome, amazing. Um, now, now you, get, you have to understand, DNH has been around for a long, long time here in Wilmington. I mean, I, when I was like 15 years old, we used to walk up to 4th Street and order either a beef patty, chicken patty, or oxtail, but now we, we've grown. Let's see what this chicken's all about. Now, all right. Now, are, is now this- Now, here's the thing. Now, so I- we had a guy working here a while back who okay. was actually Jamaican. Okay. And I don't know if he Looks was just good. I don't know if he was just being nice to me. He said that this jerk chicken was good. Okay. okay? But he seemed to dispute okay. in some way the the authenticity. Right. You know, he said maybe real jerk chicken should be should be drier or something like yeah, that. But yeah. here's the thing. This jerk chicken is moist. It's delicious. Right. It's just, it's so spicy. You can smell the spice like coming through, like yeah. penetrating through the foam. It's, now, it's incredible. Now, now, how are we going to judge this? Or well, how are we going to rate it? I don't want to judge it because, you know, is it is it the rice to the cabbage ratio? The, the Well, here's the thing. The guy who makes it, I should really know his name because I've talked to him, you know, about a million times. <laughs> right. Um, and we rode the train together uh, almost every day for a couple of years. Gotcha. Um, but I don't know his name, as okay. it turns out. Um, he's very soft-spoken. He doesn't say a lot down there. Down there right, he, just, he, he does just not say a lot. Cook and just yeah, he cooks. He gives you the food. He's very happy to give you no, the food. Thank you. The just, food is very good. Just he just go. gives it to you. <laughs> but man, the this chicken is special. And if you have the chance to go there, it's not. There's no frills. It comes in a box like this. Yeah. They no, don't dress it up. Yeah. You're not going to get the plating that you but want. It but it is it's, just delicious jerk chicken. So right. let's go ahead. I'm gonna need some water. <laughs> you I'm want some need, water? I'm gonna need some water. Shannon, it's a little spicy. I'm gonna need some water. I'm gonna need some water. Nobody, Shannon, we need we water. We need water. Oh my God. It's like, it's like I need a cold word to eat this. Well, but why is it that it's so spicy to you, but not to but me? But it's so good. It is good. It's real good. It's better it's, than, I don't know if he cooks it for a day <laughs> right, right, or a week. Right, right. But it just falls off the bone. It's delicious. Oh my gosh, amazing. It's perfect. I mean, I, Thank again, you. I love it. I don't know, I haven't been to Jamaica. I haven't tried all of the different jerk chickens that right. are out there. But I just know I that need. this is what I, like, I go to Philly, I live in Philly, I go to jerk chicken places, I cannot find jerk chicken mm -mm. that tastes this good. That cabbage is amazing. So, we are going to be taking a tour of Wilmington's jerk chicken offerings. Yeah. We know that coming up we've got what uh, who, what we got Bull Bay, Bull Bay, which is a new place. Right. We got um, right here right here a block from our from our from our studio here. Yeah, yeah. We got um, um, the formerly known cook from Janelle's which is on Union Street now um, Christabel's is the name is the name of the of the, the location that we're going to go to and I we can't wait to try that. And but, then the uh, and then another one is just I call it like the yellow place on the yellow place the on yellow Fourth place. Street. Yeah, right? I heard they were good too. So. Yeah. Oh no, not Fourth Street. It's down. Is it Second Street? Second Street. Yeah. No, Fourth. Right on the corner of Fourth. Oh, it's on Fourth. Yeah. Okay. The yellow place on Fourth. You guys know what we're talking about. We're trying that place too. Mm -hmm. That place is very well respected. I think it's a it's it's a sleeper. So. Okay, I'm done. Um, anyway, D and H. All the Absolutely way. delicious. The cabbage, the rice, the chicken. Falls off the bone, so tender, so juicy. You know how they say we're gonna give you five stars. Mm -hmm. On this, we're gonna get five breasts. <laughs> no. <laughs> five what? Five breasts. You know, like five stars. You get five breasts to let you know if your chicken is good. Like chicken breasts. Chicken breasts. Just five chicken breasts. Five, five breasts. That's, I don't think okay, that works. We, we the way five you, stars. I don't think that works the way you think it works. Five stars. All right. I like it. I like it a lot. So that's it. So stay tuned for more jerk chicken. The Wilmington Show. Hey guys, the YouTube algorithm requires that I tell you to like, 
comment, and subscribe. But I also wanted to tell you that if you have a Wilmington story that you want featured on the show, please submit it at stories.wilmington.love. We love to hear from you.